Welcome to the Cahill Club. In this video, you will learn how to use your Joy-On Cahill device and its app. We will start with instructions on how to pair your device and create an account. First, you need to download our free app, Joy-On Cahill, from the App Store or Google Play. Make sure you have a Bluetooth activated on your smartphone and that your Cahill is fully charged. In the top right corner of the exercises or massage screens, you will find the Cahill icon. Click this icon to pair Cahill with your smartphone. Turn on your Cahill by long pressing the power button for three to five seconds until the light starts flashing. Then click on Pair Cahill and it will be paired with your smartphone. Once paired, the icon in the top right corner of the exercises screen will turn pink to show that it has successfully paired with your device. It will now also show the remaining battery of your Cahill. If the Cahill icon is totally pink, it means it is fully charged. If it is almost completely white with a small pink portion, it indicates low battery. Important! To turn off your Cahill or use it without the app, you must unpair it first by clicking your Cahill icon again. Once unpaired, the icon will turn completely white. To take advantage of all the features of your Cahill, you need to create an account. Make sure you have an internet connection and simply click on Account, which is located in the bottom right corner. Click on the girl icon and then on Sign Up. Fill out all the fields and click on Sign Up. Finally, select where you bought your Cahill from and you will have successfully created an account. Now that you have an account, you are able to check your progress using My Calendar. We will cover this feature later. Next, we suggest starting with the introduction, How to Use Joy on Cahill. If you are a beginner, we recommend that you carefully read all the instructions to ensure proper use. Here you will find information about how to pair your Cahill, how to track your training and progress, how to clean your Cahill, how to insert your Cahill and recommended positions for training, and how to perform the grip and contraction speed exercises. Once you are ready, click on Start and follow the audio instructions from the app. The audio voice will guide you and explain when you should contract and when to relax. After you complete this, you will be ready to start exercising. We recommend beginning with assessment mode. This mode is the perfect tool to check the current strength of your pelvic muscles. You will perform the exercises you have learned before. At the end of the assessment test, you will get your results. Results are divided into two categories, grip and contraction speed exercises. The colored bars indicate your current status, green for strong, yellow for normal, and red for weak. The number at the end of the bars indicates the strength of your pelvic floor muscles, measured in grams per second. Factors such as giving birth, gynecological surgery, or an active sex life have an impact on these results, so there are no good or bad results. Simply focus on improving your scores. Perform the assessment periodically, you will be surprised by how much you improve. For checking your progress, just click on My Calendar. Another feature in the Cahill app is manual training. This mode is the perfect tool to get familiar with your pelvic muscles and to find the correct position. It also offers great help to users that find the grip or contraction speed games too difficult when first starting out to exercise. Additionally, Physical therapists and doctors use this mode to create custom workouts for their patients. Our staff doctors have designed custom workouts. Go to our blog to check them out. Click on Timer to easily customize your workout. Here you can adjust the number of repetitions, the duration of each contraction, and the rest time between them. The vibration notification gives you a short vibration when the rest time starts. You can activate or deactivate it, same as the audio guide, by simply sliding the pink buttons on or off. Once you have finished customizing your workout, go back by clicking on the top left corner. 
click on play to start your training. The graphics indicate the pressure being applied to Cahill by your pelvic muscles. Make sure to relax your pelvic muscles during each rest. The horizontal graph should be blank. You can pause and resume your workout by clicking on the central button. Make sure that you are logged into your account and have an internet connection so your workouts are saved in My Calendar. And now it's time to have some fun exercising. Let's begin with grip exercises. With these exercises, you practice holding the contraction for a longer period of time. These exercises will improve your vaginal grip strength for a healthy pelvic floor. Make sure to read the game instructions before you click Start. There are four levels, and you need to complete each level successfully in order to access the next one. Click on a level that you have unlocked to start exercising. Contract your pelvic muscles as hard as possible to lift the weights and hold for six seconds until the countdown gets to zero and you feel the short vibration. This vibration indicates you have completed a repetition and that you can relax. We recommend to rest for six seconds between each repetition. In order for the animated cat to lift the weights, your initial squeeze must be over 50 on the power meter. After the cat lifts the weight, squeeze strength can be less than 50, but must be higher than zero. At the bottom of the screen, you can find the gripping force and endurance of your last repetition on the left side, compared to your best records from this training session on the right side. The endurance score measures the number of seconds that you held a constant level of contraction. To turn off the audio and the music, click on the pause button. Remember, you will have to finish the number of repetitions that the level requires in order to unlock the next level. At the end of your exercise session, you will get a final score report, which will be saved in My Calendar. Your goal is to keep on improving the two scores and progress through the levels. After you have finished with the grip game, you may continue your workout with the contraction speed exercises. These exercises have you contract and relax your pelvic floor muscles quickly. These fun exercises will improve your vaginal contraction speed for better bladder control and stronger pelvic muscles. Make sure to read the game instructions before you click Start. As with the grip exercise game, you need to complete each level successfully in order to access the next one. Click on an unlocked level to start exercising. This exercise game requires you do a little fishing. Start contracting as fast and as hard as you can to cast your line, then hold the contraction for two seconds and relax. As soon as you see contract quickly on the screen, you've caught a fish. You need to start reeling in your catch as soon as possible, otherwise you'll lose your catch. To do this, contract your pelvic floor again before the countdown reaches zero. If you fail to contract before the countdown reaches zero, the rod will be reeled in, but there won't be a fish at the end of the line. You let your catch get away. If you miss a total of three times, you will need to press the pause button, then quit to manually restart the exercise. Therefore, in order to catch one fish or finish one repetition, you actually need to do two contractions one contraction to make your cast, and a second one when you see contract quickly appear on the screen to catch the fish. Make sure to contract before the countdown reaches zero or you'll lose your catch. At the bottom of the screen, you can see the contraction strength. While doing the exercises, you can see the number of fish caught, the total number of fish required to pass the level, and the elapsed exercise time in the upper left corner of the screen. One app feature that you will love is the massage mode. Click on the massage icon to use your Cahil as a massager. To remote control your Cahil, your smartphone must be within 15 to 30 feet range. Make sure you don't cover the antenna and that it is facing up or towards the mobile phone. There are four massage patterns, steady, wave, intermittent, 
and crescendo. Try them all and find your favorite one or have someone else in control. You can start and pause the vibration by clicking on the different massage patterns in the app. When the massage pattern is active, it will turn pink. Adjust the vibration intensity with the horizontal slider or click on the plus and minus symbols. The steady massage pattern is an excellent mechanism to learn which muscles to contract. Use it initially to stimulate your pelvic floor muscles and contract them at the same time. And now we will explain a bit more about Account and My Calendar. By clicking on Account, you can access My Calendar, Settings, and Extra Information. You can access your profile by clicking on the girl icon. If you have logged out, you can also sign in or sign up by clicking on this icon. Here you can edit your profile details and change your login password. My Calendar is the perfect tool to check your progress. All the trainings that you do with your Cahil are saved in My Calendar, but remember that you have to be logged into your account and have an internet connection, otherwise the training information won't be saved. At the top of the screen, you can select which exercise you would like to check your progress in. Assessments, exercise performed in manual training mode, grip exercises, and contraction speed exercises. For each of these exercises, you can see your training data by weeks, months, quarters, and years. By clicking on the arrows, you can move backwards or forwards in time. Next, we will analyze the data of one of the exercises so you can better understand how to track your training sessions. We will select manual training and week as the time frame. Days of the week are represented by numbers. One stands for Monday, two for Tuesday, and so on. At the bottom of the screen, you can select the information that will be displayed on the graph. Now we have selected maximum strength, therefore the graph shows the maximum strength that we achieved on the different days of the week. Clicking on the day, you can see the exact value. Below the graph, you will find a description of the information that is being displayed. In addition to the maximum strength, you can also check the average strength, the number of repetitions you have completed, and the exercising time measured in minutes. Every woman is different, so there are no good or bad results. The key is to train regularly and keep improving your results. On the main account menu, clicking on settings will give you access to set a pattern password for opening the app. Clear the app cache, check the user agreement or the app version in About Us. You can also log out from your account. Back to the main menu, you will find a link to the Joy On website, which takes you to our site. It contains a very detailed user help and troubleshooting guide that we recommend you read to get the best out of your Cahil. And last of all, if you click on Customer Support, you will find instructions on how to contact us if you have any questions or issues. We have a team of doctors and physical therapists on staff, and their goal is to help you to achieve better results and regain your confidence. So don't hesitate to contact us. We are happy to guide you. Even though the Cahil app is the perfect tool to maximize your progress and enjoyment, you can also use your Cahil without it. Let me show you how. To use it manually, make sure you disconnect Cahil from your phone by pressing the top right icon from the exercise or massage screen in the app. Once unpaired, Cahil will go into pressure mode. Cahil's vibrating motor will provide a vibration proportional to the applied pressure. In other words, the harder you squeeze, the stronger the vibration you will feel. This mode is great to get started. It will help you to get familiar with your pelvic muscles and find the correct position. With a short press on the power button, your Cahil will go into vibrating mode so you can use it as a vibrating egg. It is ideal to relax your pelvic muscles after a hard workout. Short press the power button again and you will switch back to pressure mode. To turn off your Cahil, simply hold the power button down for five seconds. 
To end this tutorial, we are going to show you how to charge and check the battery level of your Cahil. Simply plug the charging pin into Cahil's charging port and plug the USB end into a power adapter, computer, or power bank. Make sure you plug the charging pin in firmly and do not be afraid to push it in. You will not break it. During charging, the LED indicator light will be on. In case the light turns off immediately after starting the charge, please unplug it and insert it into Cahil again, making sure it is plugged in firmly. It takes about three to four hours to fully charge. Once Cahil is fully charged, the LED light will turn off. Remember, you can check the battery life of your Cahil by pairing it with your smartphone and looking at how full the Cahil icon is if it is fully charged, it will be totally pink. Welcome to the Cahil Club. Do not hesitate to contact us anytime if you have issues or questions, no matter how small. We are always available to help.